So here we are, about to take a tour of the, uh, the organ chamber and where we drop the snow from. Uh, my name is Steve, most of you guys probably know me. I've um, been here for a long time. I think I've been on the program since 1989 or so, but uh, either way, um, me and my buddy Nate, who you might see in a minute, we uh, dropped the snow from top of the church um, during Blow, 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 and uh, we're going to go take a tour. Here we are in the organ chamber right now. Um, this is Nate. Uh, we sneak through here during a uh, grand choir dialogue, um, which uh, most of you know as Jagu, or Gig Out, as Becky calls it. Um, <laughs> we sneak up here and we listen to the piece inside the organ because it's, uh, it's pretty incredible. But this is the organ chamber. This is where all the magic happens. Um, we go basically right on through here and up to where the snow drops. Here's the big wooden pipes I was telling you about. They actually go oh, all yeah. the way up. Wow. They're huge. Oh yeah. I stand next to them when uh, when Becky's playing, and they actually blow the air like so hard <laughs> that it cools us off. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. Fun kind of. What is that? What is that? Just watch the back wall here. Here's the plaster. Yeah. Wow. Can we uh, unplug some of them right there. Let me go make sure. No, they're on. Oh, the, this one up here. Oh, that one is just turned off. Yeah, yeah, you can hear it booming. So there's another flight of stairs. Yeah, we'll just do one person at a time on the ladder. And when you get up, you kind of have to twist your body to the side to get through the opening. Right now we're in a, uh, I don't know how wide this staircase is, it's got to be only like three feet wide if that. Not even, yeah. Ugh, so let's just continue our climb. Alright, yep. So just All watch right. the obstructions, so you don't get stabbed. Alright. One person on the ladder at a time. Yeah, it went right down along that rail. Right there? Yep. Oh, I see it. You know what it is? That's my, uh, my light. Wow. wow, there's Pastor John. Hello! That's yeah. amazing. That neat. So that's yep. about the amount of weight I want to put on that right there. Oh, okay. That's so the, people often the ask the us yep. how we the the uh, the how we go out. about yeah. dumping the snow, and it's not uh, it's not quite that simple. Um, what we do is the snow comes in these large shredded pieces, some of which are, you know, seven inches long. So what we do is we, we pour all the snow in here during, uh, uh, what is it, uh, hauling the ivy and uh, we break it all up um, with our hands and uh, prepare it all for you know, hopefully getting rid of all the big pieces and uh, when the song actually starts we'll do one of these kind of things and slowly feed it off the edge of the off the edge of the clip oh there, goodness, there it is. and uh, it's a very slow calculated uh, calculated procedure and um, that's pretty much how we do it in a nutshell. It's not uh, not as simple as just pouring it right out the chute. It is not. So. <laughs> and how many uh, how many feet up are we from the bottom? I want to say we're sixty, something like that. Uh, it sounds about right. Uh, I can't remember exactly, but I think it's about sixty feet. Again, Al could probably correct me on that. So uh, another another often asked question is uh, why these chutes are here. Um, if this, this is just here for the snow, and uh, the answer is no. Um, what happens is during the course of the year, there's two big lighting fixtures, two of these guys. It's a 1,000 watt Fresnel, and uh, this there's uh, one for the altar, and there's one for the um, the entire front of the church. Um, they're focused a little bit differently, and Al has control of those with the uh, dimmers next to the organ. Um, so what we do is we build this cardboard structure in here. Um, for the purposes of the snow and we remove it every year. In fact, uh, Nate and I were talking about this. Uh, this year, we think this cardboard is probably 11 or 12 years old. Uh, <laughs> we just keep reusing it and reusing it and reusing yeah, it. Yep, so. 
That is the, the point of these little shoots right here. Wow. There. Got it. And we were told you cannot walk on this plaster right here, which is... That is correct. Um, you can walk on the, uh, the structural steel that's holding up the mesh work, but anywhere in between, yeah. um, you, you, really should, you really you shouldn't be drop. walking. Exactly. All right. Well, thanks guys for the tour. No problem. Hope and, you enjoyed it. And be safe. Yeah. Happy New Year. <laughs>